Today marked the start of Suffolk County Executive Steve Ballone's second term in office. And though the county exec painted a rosy picture about Suffolk's future during the ceremony, protesters outside were hoping to spoil the mood. File Swan's Kevin Vesey has more. And with that, Suffolk County Executive Steve Ballone was sworn in to his second term by Governor Andrew Cuomo, beginning another four years in office. During his first term, the Democrat from Babylon pushed an agenda meant to make Suffolk more attractive to younger residents, including the construction of apartment buildings near train stations and improving water quality by expanding the county's sewer system. In his address at Suffolk Community College in Brentwood on Wednesday, Ballone was optimistic about accomplishing those goals. I truly do believe that our best days are ahead of us. Six years, no contract! But the mood was very different just outside the ceremony, where county sheriff's deputies and their families staged this protest up in arms because their union has been without a contract for the last six years. We are here uh, to show this county executive that uh, this corruption is not going to be tolerated and we're asking to be treated fairly like he treated all the other police unions. But according to these residents, four more years of Balone is just fine. I think he's a, a great guy. I think he's a great person for our community, and he's done, a, he's done a lot for us. If he can do what he did in Babylon, then we'll be okay. Ballone wound up with 57% of the vote when he defeated Republican challenger James O'Connor in November. Kevin Vesey, Fios 1 News.